Welcome back. This is Chris Spiker, Minding Your Business, Lancaster Chamber of Commerce. Our next guest from Southern California Bank, Carlos Huiza. Welcome. Hey, uh, pleasure to be here today with you, uh, Chris. Uh, it's uh, hot out there, but it always feels good out here when, you know, when it's not so much of a wind uh, issue for me. Well, us old timers, we, we like shade, you know, we like during the summer, you got to be inside a little bit. I, I can, I can imagine too. I, it's not just the old timers. I think myself as well. I, I think well, I like the shade. Find the shade. Don't look straight into the sun. If you got to commute or drive, try to go with the sun, not against the sun every morning. Okay. Sounds like you really planned your <laughs> commutes pretty well, man. I don't, I don't do that that well. And your daughter is excited that you're on the radio today. I, you know what? Uh, she's nine years old, and I know she was just like, Dad, I can't believe you're going to do that. That's fantastic. That's great. So I know she is. I, and my son as well, who's 13. Because you were on a billboard one time. I was. You know, I, I've had the opportunity to have a little bit of uh, exposure, I think, in banking. It's it's always good, right? I mean, as it, with any business, right? I mean, you'll take any opportunity you have that's, you know, quality, and, and I have. And... And that was a funny story because, you know, you know, it was down, way, way down in the commerce area. And, you know, my, my family hadn't seen it. So on a Sunday, you know, trying to avoid traffic, going yep. the right way yep. at the right time, uh, we drove down there and it was like this huge billboard that the company I was with before had put up with me and it was fantastic. And your and they, face was on it? <laughs> my face was on it. And your family just went crazy. They went crazy. It was, it was funny to do that. We only saw it once. Yeah. <laughs> Well, that, that'll, it'll last you forever, though. It was a good memory for them as well. Okay, so now with the radio and the video. Yeah, this is uh, this is remarkable. This is new for me. I, I, I done a little producing a little bit back in my uh, years in, in banking and marketing, but uh, this is this is great. This is a great opportunity to, you know, come out and just, you know, to have a conversation. Yeah. Southern California Bank. Bank of Southern California. Bank of Southern California. That's correct. That's correct. And, that and you're on Lancaster Boulevard. We are, uh, 539 uh, West Lancaster Boulevard. Uh, you know, we actually have a pretty good spot there, you know, no issues with parking. Uh, and, and you know what, to be quite frank and, and honest, I think that the boulevard does a good job of actually kind of managing some of that as well. Uh, and if someone has a hybrid, you know, we have a, you know, plug-in right there in your ah. charging station. So it's always, it's always a bonus. And they could, if they planned it right, uh, the post office is right next door. Right next door. They're right next to us. So my world is bank, chamber of commerce, <laughs> post office. <laughs> very convenient. Yeah. We, we do it just for you as well, but for our clients. It's very convenient. We, we've gone through a little bit of a, a remodel, uh, you know, over the last couple of years. It was a little bit of an acquisition with us in a merger. And we're focused on our business clients and our consumer clients, but uh, the, bench, the, the branch is looking really, really good, Chris. It's, it looks amazing. And uh, the team that I have there, they're so good and they're so personable. You know, I've always been very fortunate to have worked with good people. And Angie and Cheryl and, you know, Priscilla and having all those folks, they're really, really good people too. And they sit at their own desks. Yeah, this is not your typical. So, you know, for, for your audience, you know, it, let me try to describe it really well. I mean, you know, I, I've been in banking for almost 20 years. And, you know, one of the cool things about banking is that, you know, I, the way I remember is, you know, you used to come in and you used to be able to kind of, I go back to like getting a passbook in which every time you made a deposit or withdrawal, you know, the bank would actually stamp, you know, right. your deposit was, so you would know what, what it was, yep, right? Right. And, um, you know, for us, it's, it's kind of back to the, that, that kind of feel, and, and it's very different. It's very warm. You, you walk in and you actually sit down. You have a conversation. You can grab a candy if you want to, you know, grab That's a candy. Right, yeah. And, you know, now that it's hot, we offer water, of course, right? But uh, you, you sit down and you have a conversation and you, you do your transaction and, and you can go on your way, you know. So it, it, that's what I think makes us a little bit different to that personal, you know, feel and touch when you walk in. I make a deposit every once in a while and, you know, I don't always have my account number and the yep. ladies look it up for me. Yep. They, they do a fantastic job. Yep. They really do. I mean, you know, uh, especially, again, uh, with Cheryl and Angie, they've been uh, in that particular office for a number, number of years, and they know every single client. They really do. I mean, it's it's amazing. They don't know every account number. Yours, maybe they do, uh, Chris, but uh, they, they do. They know where to find it. They know where to find it, yeah. for sure. And that's the thing. They, they know where to look. Yeah, I, I mean, and again, they're they're very they're tremendous. I, I'm I'm so happy to have a team that's so engaged uh, with with the clients, and they really care. Right? And I'm sure other other folks do as well. But but I know again the experience of just walking in and just being greeted, and they know you, and, and again, you know, fill 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 out your deposit slip, all those things. That client experience it's so important to us at the bank. You know, Cheryl, 
for one, has been there a long time. Yes, I and, think. And through the years, uh, the staff of that bank, uh, through the various owners, right. have they have been very uh, promotion oriented. So yeah. the three people from the office would be at all the chamber events yep. and all sorts of events around the community. But you've been in the banking world for quite a while too. Yeah, I have, and and you know that's one of the things when it comes to you know the banking war and I think just you know in the business world right I mean I think that you really have to lend yourself to be out there and put yourself out there and just be engaged and, and be in the community because I think that those pay off and you know to be quite frank with you uh, one of the things I, I was excited for you know for doing this was I, yeah sure I want to promote the bank and you know get my name out there but that's really not that's secondary to me at the end of the day is you know I'm excited about helping people and, and I think that when you Put yourself on the community when you go to the festivals when you go and, and, and look what's going on there's so much going on out here in the ab it, it really is exciting you know uh, as it continues to be and there's so many people that are motivated as well to really kind of businesses out there to really put themselves out there and i think as a community we, we got to really support that we really have to i mean when you see the taco festival right you know, one of our clients out there when you see you know the poppy you know, coming out. I mean, which is amazing. You saw I just, the wildflowers. Oh my God! It was the first time in my life. You know, I've seen it through you know Hugh Hauser, yeah. right? Yep. You know, and I've never been. And I took my family, and we spent like the entire day, the, the, you know, the entire day there, and it was amazing. It really was incredible. We took like two hundred pictures. You know, I mean, it was we were all over that place. It but you didn't amazing. spend two hundred dollars. No, and and there's was great a value. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> right. Yeah, that was a once every few years show. That was an amazing show. You know what I thought it was interesting though when when the poppies were coming out and it was like everyone was getting excited. I didn't realize that there were other areas too, right? I I guess going to Corona and what have you, and and I watched on the news the fact that people were pulling over next to the freeway to actually go see. And I was like, wow, how dangerous is that, right? And I very dangerous. And I'm just like, wow, why everyone should come here? I mean, maybe it's the you know. I know a lot of people come through, you know, throughout the years and, and throughout the seasons, but this was just, I think, an amazing year for, you know, for that activity to do as a family activity. Well, guess what? There's a lot going on in the high desert. I couldn't agree with you more. Yeah. I couldn't agree with you more. So what are the advantages of your bank? It's, it's not a big box. It's not a major name that you see on TV all night long. Yeah, you know, I, I believe, again, you know, I think that most, you know, financial institutions, you know, the bigger banks, you know, I mean, a, a checking account is a checking account, a savings account is a savings account. But I think for us, it's having what you were alluding to earlier, right? You know, having those bankers that are professional and we're so experienced in what we do. I mean, like I mentioned, I, I've been in banking for 20 years. Sure, has been my goodness, at the same location, close to 20 years, I, I believe. And, and Angie's been in banking for over 10 years, I believe, by now. So having that experience, you know, having someone that you can call, and again, everything's great, you know, in the banking world, you know, with your account until it's not great. Yeah. You know, and for us, you know, we focus on deposit solutions, right, and people, you know, want to bank with us as well. But we also, you know, want to give back and, and, and provide some lending opportunities out there. And we specialize on that, uh, commercial lending, business lines of credit. And, and you know, th this is what I tell my clients. It's really three guys. It's myself, you know, the loan officer, and the person, you know, the chief credit officer, you know, who's tremendous, who has so much experience. And that's it, really. You know, we look at a deal, and, and, and we want to give you an opportunity to really, Won't you know, take long do this an for answer. you. For sure. And, and in addition to that, we're just fast. That's, I think, what sets us apart, you know. That, that should be everybody's goal. <laughs> I, I think it should be. So what's the deal of online banking versus having a place to go? You know, I think that nowadays uh, clients, uh, they want choices. Uh, that's, that's what it was. You know, if you, if you go back, back in the 80s when the ATMs were first introduced, right, so I'll go back a little bit, you know, to that. You know, we thought, oh, you know, the, the brick and mortar is going to go away. You know, I, I think that what clients want is the choice, you know, on how they want to do their banking. They want to go to an ATM, fantastic, you know. They want to go into a branch, fantastic. You want to go into, you know, use mobile banking, we have all the technology as well. So it's really about providing choice. I think that's where the industry is going. Now, do they need, you know, do, do banks need those mega boxes and what have you? Perhaps, you know, some of them may still do it, but I think that's that's going to continue to change in the future. Banking is changing for the best, I think. Well, that's good. 
So you, you still do CDs over there? We do. Yeah. We do. I mean, absolutely. You know, we have, you know, every product that, you know, uh, any competitor of mine would have out there, um, I think that we just do it better. That's really what it is. You know, we have the technology to back it. We have, you know, again, the, the, the team that really cares and the experience to do it. And as I mentioned before, we, we're just fast. I mean, it's just, you know, when you're not, you know, as big, you, you're able to make those decisions quicker. And I think that's a, that's a tremendous uh, advantage that I have uh, other, uh, you know, over my competitors. Well, it's a small bank, but it's a big bank. It sure is. It sure is. I mean, it's a tremendous people, uh, you know, with our uh, leadership team and, and, you know, some folks that are, you know, work behind the scenes and they're, you know, they're so warm. And, and again, you know, there's no 800 number. I mean, you, you call us and we'll put you in touch with the right person if it's, you know, additional services that you need. And there's, you know, we're, we're really flat and, and that is a competitive advantage. I can tell you that some companies out there struggle just because they, you know, they all want to provide great service. You know, they all say they provide great service, but it's only those that can actually do it and actually do it really well and execute it at a high level and really care for your clients at the end of the day. You got to do what's right for your, your client first and foremost, and that's part of our mission. Actual action. Uh, contact information. Yeah, I, you know, absolutely. We're on the boulevard, but, you know, I always give my number out, and it's super simple, you know, 661-673-3057. Uh, uh, if, you know, anyone has any questions and I can be a resource, by all means, just give me a call. I'm the guy that, you know, answers the phone. <laughs> you enjoy the chamber so much you tried to, tried to join truck twice. I, I did, I That's did. a story for another time. That's, that'll be another. <laughs> Absolutely, yes. I, uh, you know, again, lots of opportunity for businesses out there to promote themselves. I think it's important, and we got to support them in the community. Carlos Huiza, Bank of Southern California. Thanks for being a chamber member. Appreciate it. Thank you so much.